This is another personal security recommendation, and this is an app access audit. And so again, I'd like to direct you to go to your Google account. So we're gonna go back to our Google account. So remember account.google.com. And I'd like you to go back to security again and scroll down to third-party apps with account access. And I want you to click manage third-party access. So Google account, account.google.com, security tab, and third-party apps. Let's open up third-party apps. And I just want you to review this and delete anything that no longer needs access to your account. So I'm no longer using Calendly. Let's remove that. Boom, gone. Nest Audio. I don't think I'm using that anymore. Bye-bye. Miro. I'm not using that. Bye-bye. So I'm recommending that you do this to make sure that you're not giving access to anyone that doesn't need it. I'm worried about these particular apps potentially being hacked. What happens is from time to time, you know, we need to we need to fix one thing, right? Like I've got split names as a plugin to my Google Docs because I've used that add-on a couple of times, right? And sometimes you use an add-on like five years ago to get something done in a Google Doc and you get the thing done, but then you forget about the add-on and then the developer forgets about the add-on and they don't update it and then a vulnerability in that add-on is exposed. And anyone who still has the add-on connected to their Google account for who knows how many years then gets hacked and they get their account access compromised. So my recommendation here is to just, you know, be careful what you leave with access to your Google account and just go through and as a discipline, remove things that are no longer used. So widget pack, oh, I know what that is. That's for our website. Okay, don't delete that one, Pete. You've also got apps that let you sign in with Google as well. So, you know, I've got a number of here that I've used to sign in with Google. Just gonna review all of those. They all look okay for me. EV, I don't need that on my business account. Can get rid of that. Yep, just removing each one of those one by one as they're no longer needed. So just go in there, give that one a bit of a cleanup. That's something that you can recommend to your team to do as well. If you like this content, please hit subscribe and hit the bell notification so you can be notified when we go live or drop new content on the channel. Now, if you'd like to connect with us, hit us up on social media or join our free community group. All the links to that are right below this video. If you'd like to learn more about Google Workspace and the technology ecosystem, you can join our free Genius Academy by transferring your billing across to IT Genius, or you can join a Workspace Basics Bootcamp. Now, if you're a business owner and you're interested in an audit on your technology stack or your Workspace account, or you're looking to do a project in the tech world, well, you can take advantage of our free consultation. And if you need help right now, then consider joining Concierge or taking up a quick fix with our team for professional support for your tech stack.